Fulfer! It's always encouraging to see the younger generations embracing education. Yeah, I need to talk to you about the Augur of Dunlane, please. Well now, there's a name I haven't heard in some time. My goodness, it's been years since I've spoken with him. I suppose he's still down in the midden, but I haven't checked. The what now? Are you going to see him? Do tell him hello for me, won't you? In that cellar? What, what, what is the midden? Underneath the college. It's not the nicest place, so if you go down there, please do be careful. All right. Uh, tell me a little bit more about him. Not the midden, the auger. How many horsepower does it have? It was all before my time, you understand. I've heard the stories, the, the same as anyone else. He was a brilliant student, an accomplished wizard. Delved into magic in a way none had seen before. And he turned himself into a brick. But I think he became too focused on just how much power he could acquire. That's what led to the accident. What accident? Did he get turned into green? Do you remember what I first told you? No. About how not being able to control magic could destroy you? Oh, now I remember, yeah. I didn't simply mean it could kill you. The Augur's accident is another very real type of a life destroyed. Well, it's been described as an accident. I can't imagine it was intentional. Something must have gone wrong, and he ended up in the state he's in now, fused to the energies that flow through the college. Wait, is he actually a brick? I've never felt it appropriate to ask him about it, about how that must feel, or I suppose if he can feel at all. Okay, is and, he a statue? And too, many, too many wizards forget. Be careful not to bring up that which you cannot put down. There's a problem with one of the Jarls here in Skyrim. He's been complaining of a member of the college running amok in his hold. Oh. We have, of course, severed all ties with the mage in question, but the Jarl isn't appeased. So the mage needs to be taken care of, if you understand me. You want to put him down? I would hate to see our reputation further tarnished. I guess we could deal with that guy. We'll go find the auger, and then we'll get rid of this rogue mage. That, wait, isn't the midden somewhere around here? You're, yeah, it's somewhere around here. It's in one of these rooms, right? Oh, yeah, it's right over here. Yeah, there we go. Ooh, I wonder if there's undead down here. Because if there's undead down here, I can try using those scrolls for Jizargo. There were undead down here. We killed most of them. They may have come back. Skeletons. Broken apart to pieces. <laughs> Trying to trip you up. Mm-hmm. They're trying to get, they're trying to, ow, <laughs> chicken, why? Pick, pick, pickaxe. He, he just threw a freaking pickaxe at me. Makes me sad. Severed bond of trust. They did not level that door. <laughs> well, that doesn't look good. <laughs> it's kind of cool looking. Yeah, but you know, it's not exactly welcoming seeing that first thing when you enter a place. Maybe it's intentionally there to discourage you from entering. I guess. There is no help for you here. Oh yeah, I'm not down here for help. I'm down here to be a help. They hired me to clean out your, your, your monster problem. You got a bunch of undead or ghouls or whatever. There is no solace in knowing what is to come. That's fine. I don't really care about that. I'm down here to kill some ghouls. Your perseverance will only lead to disappointment. Hey man, I'm used to disappointment. Every single day of my life is disappointment. Stop talking at me! I'm trying to get rid of some ghouls. He's still going. He's still going in there. Equipping Jizargo's test scrolls. I guess it's this one. For 30 seconds, opponents in melee range take 10 extra points of fire damage. Hello, go. test subject! Whoa! <laughs> okay. Everyone stand back. <laughs> wow, the skeletons did Watch more it. damage to me. I'm on your side. Sorry, Janessa, I'm sorry. This Zargo's not very good at his job. Or he's too good at his job. Ow. Oh, whoa, whoa. oh no, it did. It did. You're right. Ow. Is Chicken attacking me? <laughs> the bones. Or is it? Oh, it's the bones. Just the bones flying over the place. Oh! <laughs> the relic ring finger. Well, that seems ominous as heck. That is very ominous. See, I told you it was ominous when we came down here. I th Ow! I keep stepping on the frickin' bones. I told you it was ominous when we came down here. You gotta get someone to come down here. Oh, uh, no. Oh, it's, it's a chicken. Chicken, what are you doing? 
Oh, I think he's actively attacking me for some reason. He is. He's upset. He got too close to you, I guess. Chicken, please stop attacking me. Can we, <laughs> how do we? How do we? How do we make him stop? I. Because he's he's not going to now. <laughs> he's chicken is pissed at you. Yeah, he's real mad at me. I guess he really wanted to kill those skeletons. We've got two things down and this very ominous relic finger. Let's touch the finger. See what happens. I did. Nothing happens. Oh, okay, good. I don't have a ring for it. I think that's the problem. Oh wait. The missing students were found in the midden this morning. Dead, as expected. I mean, what? <laughs> as expected? I wouldn't expect anything else, considering that apparently the part of the College of Winterhold's curriculum is die. <laughs> it's, on no, the, it's on the syllabus. None of us bothered keeping a detect life charm for the search at this point. <laughs> Bodies are found together, each suffering the same deformities. Peeled and bubbling skin on the arms and face. Conjurer's burn, as it's commonly referred to around the college. I wish they would have told me about conjurer's burn before I paid my tuition. There's little doubt they were attempting a summoning ritual well beyond their capabilities. Again, do not raise up that which you cannot put down. Mm -hmm. The relic nearby put any doubt in this theory to rest. I admit that I have never seen one like it. A large segmented sculpture of a gauntlet, the Daedric Sigil. And place it upon the palm. I think that's Oblivion. Oblivion. Attempts to move it were in vain. I must show it to the Archmage Sadoth. During his upcoming visit, perhaps he will know more. While we couldn't move the relic, I was able to pry four rings from it. I'm sure there's a connection between them and the ritual the students were attempting. I'll store these in the Arcanium until we can consult with the Conjuration Master to learn more. That's not who the Archmage is. Maybe this is an older Yeah, note? That, yeah this, this note's been here a while. I see. All right, well, the Arcanium has the rings that I need, but we still got to kill another skeleton, so... Got to test that out, yeah. Who's doing this? Stop sacrificing goats! God damn it! You guys gotta stop sacrificing goats all the time. Actually, we probably don't want to find the rings and put them on there because, once again, I'm not summoning shit that I don't want. Ah, oh, god, frickin' bones. <laughs> I swear to god, those skeletons are deadlier dead as a regular skeleton than they are as an actual animated skeleton. <laughs> yeah. There is no solace. I know, there's no solace come. in knowing what is to come. I know, I get it. Your I understand. God damn it. Alright, fine. Oh, wait, no. Oh, that's a lot deeper than I thought it was. Oh my god. <laughs> it's very hot and bubbly, too. Oh, it's just that water's dripping on it. Uh, yeah. Waterfall. If it was actually hot and bubbly, I would be like, dude, what the hell are we doing? We open a hot springs here. Come on, you guys. Jacuzzi. Come on, oh. I don't remember seeing that when we walked in. Were we just not paying attention? What the heck? Okay, we're gonna ignore this. I'm gonna pretend I didn't see this uh, because I don't want, I don't want to accidentally summon something. Fire salts and ruby is a flame atronach. Frost salts and sapphire is a frost atronach. And storm atronach is void salts and amethyst. Let's make a storm atronach. We're gonna make a storm atronach. A friendly one, hopefully, we'll see. Oh, it's not happy! No, it's not happy! We made an angry one! How foolish of us! God! Wow, that thing hurt. Cesaro is eager to hear how these scrolls are working. I'm work- I'm working on it. Well, hey, hey! That's where we need to go. Alright, where are these stinking rings? Where would they be hidden? Let's see Argodian Maid, Volume 2! I mean, I guess you gotta have all the books in the library. Well, we couldn't find any rings in the Arcanum that could be used here, so we'll figure something else out. It made sense, though. Like, I, I thought that was a solution. I thought so, too, but I'm just, once again, I'm overthinking shit. Oh! Yep, see, he just opened the door. <laughs> Why did he open the door for us? I, because I, I... I was impatient. Hey. You're, um... You're an orb. Your efforts... Or in vain. It has already begun. What what has already begun? Those who have sent you have not told you what they seek. What you seek. Everyone's speaking in riddles. Uh what is it that I'm seeking? You seek that which all who wield magic seek. Knowledge. A cider summoner. Knowledge will corrupt. It will destroy. It will consume. Ignorance is bliss. You seek meaning, shelter in knowledge. You will not find it. Because I've blinded you. The Thalmor sought the same thing. And it shall lead to his end, as it has so many others. So I'm not- wait, I'm not the first one to come see you? No, though you may be the last. The one who calls himself Ancano has sought my knowledge as well. Oh! Some very different questions. 
Mm. Your path differs from most. You are being guided, pushed towards something. It is a good path, one untraveled by many. It is a path that can save your college. I will tell you what you need to know to follow it further. Should I put on some sunglasses? How long is this going to take? What do I need? You and those aiding you wish to know more about the Eye of Magnus. Is that what that big orb is called? You wish to avoid the disaster of which you are not yet aware. To see through Magnus' eye without being blinded, you require his staff. Take this knowledge to your Archmage. But you just said knowledge is dangerous. I guess some knowledge is dangerous. I, oh, well, there he goes. Well, he's gone now. And I can see. Hooray. All right. Well, we got to go back to college. And warn someone, I guess. We got to warn them that knowledge is dangerous. And, and that, that now I have knowledge that knowledge is also dangerous. And they need the staff of Magnus to consult the eye of Magnus without being blinded by the, the, the blindness. <laughs> it's just, yep. Okay. Yeah, just, yeah, it's normal. Oh, not that way. That hand with the the rings, I guess that was just a miss, a miss, a red herring, the mislead. Well, it's that's probably related to something else. We'll worry about that later. We got too many things to worry about right now. Like, how is there so much light in here, considering we're entirely underground? Hmm. Also, what was Encanto doing, talking to the light? Maybe he just wanted to know how to make a good brisket, because he's a Thalmor spy, not a cook. I was going to make it a reference to Encanto, but I, I I know absolutely nothing about that movie. Other than you hate it. Other than there's capybaras in it. It's an okay kids movie. Not a, I didn't much care for it, but I'm not a kid. Let's, let's be real here. Pixar movies have not been good since... Uh... Toy Story 3? Cars? Cars was their first misstep, I believe a lot of people would say. Yeah. Y'all tested spells. Hey, 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 um... We need to find the Staff of Magnus. I'd certainly love to have such a powerful staff, but I'm not really sure that any of us need it. A blue glowing light told us we need it! Yeah, and it's connected to that giant thing that's behind us. It's a ticking time bomb. And how do you know of this? Yeah, I was using the auger to get down into the ice, and the auger was like, Hey, by the way, you want to find the Staff of Magnus? Also, go 50 meters that way. There's some cherry salmon. Ooh. I'm impressed with your initiative. Of course, someone will need to follow up on this. You mean me, don't you? I certainly do. <laughs> Since you went so far as to seek out the auger for advice, I thought you'd be more enthusiastic. Not really. Something as specific and ancient as the Staff of Magnus. I'm not sure we'd ever find something like that. I seem to recall Mirabelle mentioning the Staff somewhat recently. Why don't you see if she can tell you anything? I'm quite pleased with your progress, you know. You've certainly proven yourself to be more than a mere apprentice. Well done. Thank you! This circlet once proved invaluable to me. I hope it can be of use to you now. Uh, no, it's fine. You can keep it. I'm not, I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna wear it. I don't wear circlets. That's, that's girl, that's girl jewelry. <laughs> Man, I got a lot of random, a lot of random quests. All right, we'll go deal with the rogue mage and then we'll come back and talk to, uh, what's your name? I'm sure that the ticking time bomb is fine for right now. It's making weird noises. Don't worry about it. Maybe in here? Is this where the mage's headquarters is? Hmm. The name of this place leads me to believe there's going to be undead inside it. Volendrong? It sounds like it. Uh, no, well, it wasn't Volendrong. It's, uh... Volenrud. Oh, okay. You were close. Yeah. Into Volendung. Into Paul Rudd. Uh-oh. Uh -oh. Paul Rudd, no! Yeah, yeah, hello! We intrude on your home, that is correct. Will you, will you submit Ow. to being killed, please? Mercy! No! <laughs> <laughs> Alright, problem solved! Alright, well, that was the rogue wizard! Hey, hey, we can find some Draugr for me to kill! Oh, it looks like you can use your test scrolls! Uh, hey, chicken, I need you to wait right here. Just Great, in case you. you get caught up in the blast. Yep, because he will. Draugr? Draugr? Yep, Draugr! Draugr! Hey, Draugr! Guess what I got? He was unaffected! It's just, it's doing something. It's a cool sword. Ooh, K 
catch the fire spells? Is it contagious? Damn. <laughs> the sword you picked up looks like that. Damn, this sword looks cool as hell. It looks like it's warped. No, that's uh, there's a name for that type of sword. I forget what it's called. Scimitar. No, because the scimitar's got like a curve to it. Mm. Scimitars are kind of like uh, kind of like what the um the red guards use. They've got oh, curved yeah. swords. Curve, curve swords. <laughs> swords. That's kind of what a scimitar is. Uh, this is like, is this a falchion? No, falchions are straight. I'm pretty sure. Uh, actually, you might be right. A falchion might be more like a big machete. A wo dao. Flamberger, that's it. Or Flamberg. That's a type of cooking things. No, that's that's flambe. No, that's a type of egg. Do you know, do you know why it's called that? Why? Because it means flame sword. Oh. It means flame bladed sword. Is, is it named that way because it looks like fire warped it? It's named that way because it's wiggly like a flame. Gotcha. Yeah, you might you might like this sword. Yeah, it's not on fire though. You could make it on fire. I think I may have accidentally hit you with it. I don't know what I'm doing with this thing. <laughs> it's hard I to do want to hit something with it. Hard to aim because it's so wiggly. I do want to hit something with it. Jeez! I haven't even trained in two-handed swords! And it took a couple minutes to knock him down. Oh no! Okay, this is fun! Maybe you should go for two-handed. Why do I like this? <laughs> We are respecking. Hey, hey, buddy, how you doing? Hey oh, I, that, that, ooh, that, I committed and I failed. <laughs> Stronger death beard, get him! Ah, cut him in half. Now, now we cut his rings to see how old he is. Ooh, that was fun. Oh, those traps That's have. A... That is, would be extremely painful if I stood still on it. I don't want to get cored. Is that the way we're going, though? Or is that... Oh, it's this next Oh, uh, I'm just... No, I'm just going this way to see what there is further down in here. Evolving you know tools. Why not? Elder's Cairn door. Oh. That's a oh. thing, apparently. Well, it started a quest. Okay, if we find the ceremonial weapons, we know where to bring them. Yeah, we'll have to come... We'll have to come back to this one. We got we got a lot of stuff on our, on our plate today. So we got to go speak with Mirabelle and Chizargo, and then we'll we'll maybe look into ceremonial weapons. Maybe. Or we'll forget about it entirely. Okay, so Chizargo's right over here, practicing spells at the wall, like try, he usually is. Try to be is. kind to this guy. Don't, mean, don't be too mean. I'm, I'm not going to be mean to him. I'm not going to be a jerk. Chizargo has heard of the Staff of Magnus. Once you are done with it, perhaps you will allow Chizargo to borrow it. <laughs> Fuck no! So mean. <laughs> I've tested your scrolls. And? Were they magnificent? I... Were they supposed to explode? Because they exploded. Uh, no. Uh, that was not supposed to happen. But Cesargo <laughs> is pleased to see that you are here and not in pieces. You are a good friend to have done this. Cesargo will not forget it. Also, Cesargo is sure your eyebrows will grow back. <laughs> What is his name? His name reminds me of something. What does his name remind me of? Jizargo. Oh, I'm thinking of Iago. <laughs> from from, uh, from Aladdin. From Aladdin and... Othello. 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 Yes, I think so. I think it's Othello. Yeah, it's Othello. I think it's Othello. I'm sorry. I, I'm, I'm sorry. My literary comprehension is not great. It's actually really good, but whatever. It re Yeah, it reminds me of Iago. That's mm. what his name... I, I think it's just the go at the end of his name. That's what I'm thinking Maybe, of. Maybe, yeah. yeah. I'm looking out for me! There you go. <laughs> I love it. It's a very short book. The mace is about strength and stamina. Oh no, I can tell you that's wrong. Yeah, there's a lot of there's a there's there's definitely some uh some decks in using a mace. Don't let anybody tell you different. They'll lie to you though and just be like, no, it's so, so stupid. I am the shadow at your back. <laughs> You're cool. <laughs> uh, I like Janessa. I'm glad you do. Janessa's my gal Friday. <laughs> <laughs> 